but also you, you got to make sure that you're looking at the corners because the corners are where you can get into trouble. And two feet away from me was this spike. Hey, what's up? It's Bill with Seeds of Nature Water Gardens. I'm out in Scapoos, Oregon, and I'm working on a brand new feature using an old feature. So story behind this is the old feature. Uh, it was full, it was a pond, beautiful pond running. Everything's fine with it. Neighbors moved in and their kid uh, accidentally fell into the pond. So um, now that they're gonna drain the pond and I'm gonna build them a brand new pondless waterfall. So no standing water, it's just gonna be really beautiful and in a better area of their yard so they can enjoy it instead of being in the back corner. So with that being said, let's get to work. <music> All right, so I got the basin in, aqua blocks, pump fault. Uh, you've seen in my other videos, you know, same thing. Got a layer of underlayment, then liner, then under, underlayment to protect the liner from the blocks and the pressure of the water pushing the plastic in the liner. I just don't want any problems in the future whatsoever. So I'm using two pieces of liner, one for the basin, and then I'm gonna put a piece of liner for the stream over top of the basin. It's really important that you overlap these correctly because water can actually wick six inches vertically. So you wanna make sure that you have at least six inches, uh, some people say eight inches, some 12 inches of overlap. Uh, but also you, you gotta make sure that you're looking at the corners because the corners are where you can get into trouble because if you fold the basin wrong, if you fold the liner basin wrong, then water can go in there. You won't even see where it's going out because it's folded, it's finding a fold and then it's just escaping and you'll, you'll never find it. So it's really important this step uh, to just get it right and make sure that you know how water works. I was foaming the rocks on the waterfall <laughs> and I turned around and two feet away from me was this spike. And I look at him like, yo, at the shadow I thought it was the homeowner <laughs> look at the spikes standing two feet away from me <laughs> All right, that's a wrap. I got everything done. I know I kind of didn't film a lot of stuff, but you know, same nitty gritty, putting the rocks there, getting the edge work done, filling her up, doing my little touch ups and stuff, but so happy with this uh, result. Always, every single water feature I build is my favorite one. So this is definitely the favorite one I've built so far. Um, I dug trench too for the homeowner. So they have a, a electrician coming out. All I gotta do is put the dirt back in the hole after he fills it up. And that's it. That's all we got. Hey, I appreciate you watching. Please uh, like and subscribe. It costs you nothing to do. Share it with your friends if you really like it. Um, follow me on. I got, I'm on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. So, all right, that's it. Peace. <laughs>